it may be a dreary and rainy Indiana fall day, but we won't let that dampen our spirits. Today, I actually have my friends with me at the Park County Covered Bridge Festival, where we're going to celebrate 31 historical covered bridges throughout the county, eat some amazing food like persimmon pudding and ham and beans, and maybe even catch a turkey leg by the end of the day. And also check out all the local vendors and artisans that Park County has to offer. So come on, let's check it out. So right here we have the best view in town and actually today you get some beautiful rapids coming from underneath the covered bridge but looks like it used to be 25 cents but today we get it for free. Yay! <laughs> So right now we're inside the Bridgeton Mill. It was established in the early 1800s, if you can imagine that, but it's still working. And they're producing everything from bread flour to grits to pancake mixes. And I can't wait to take a couple of these home and try out some new recipes. On a cool and rainy Indiana fall day, one of my first stops at any festival is gonna be to stop and pick up either some hot apple cider or a nice cup of coffee. And I'm here with Joanna from Java Aroma, and you guys are actually from Mitchell, Indiana. Yeah. Tell me a little bit about your booth. Sure, yeah, um, we started the company about a year and a half ago. Um, I started as a way to give back uh, to the people I'm getting the coffee from, the farmers. I love that, but yeah. you guys also have some specialty flavors as well. Tell us yeah, about some of your more unique ones. Sure, yeah, so we're highlighting our Thanksgiving blend. Um, so all our coffees, we do not put any artificial flavors into it. Everything comes out with each coffee. But for drinks, yes, we absolutely have like pumpkin pie and peppermint mochas. Kind of everybody's fall favorite, so I love we that. do special that, yeah. I love that, and I'm gonna have to try some of your hot apple cider. Yeah. Now Buckeyes may be an Ohio specialty, but we make amazing Buckeyes right here in the Hoosier State. All my friends already ate all of theirs. I'm the last to the party, but that just means I get to savor mine a little bit more. Who else had the yarn? Uh, I didn't know that you could do that. What did you taste? I tasted the banana fudge with cinnamon. Ooh. It is good. Jalapeno chocolate fudge. That was a specialty for today, and my tongue is on fire. I had raspberry truffle, and it was delicious. Peanut butter and banana. I did watermelon. We are having so much fun stopping by all the booths here at the festival, but this is a really special one. I'm here with Dolores, and she is oil painter and her pieces are just absolutely gorgeous so tell us a little bit about what you have here in your booth well I like to paint the landscapes uh, in all the seasons so uh, this one in particular it, my eye went right to this this is gorgeous is this a specific scene from here in uh, Park yes. County yes it's uh, behind the inn at Turkey Run State Park it's uh, on Sugar Creek. It's uh, fun to paint. I learned to paint just here in Bridgeton. There was an artist that came from Indianapolis and, and asked him if he'd give us lessons. And I love that you capture the honest to goodness Indiana in your paintings. It's just beautiful.